Uh, my name is Alex. I'm known as Alex by Design on Poshmark, Instagram, Relove, and eBay. Uh, for those of you who don't know me, I am a professional reseller on all those platforms. My ultimate goal is to try and reduce um, humanity's carbon footprint by finding items um, both low priced and high priced that have no business going into the landfill and reselling them for a very fair um, amount and hopefully try to pay my bills with it. But today I wanted to have a quick little talk about what my daily routine is so that I can work six to eight hours a day, I'm consistent, um, and I get my stuff done. So um, I'll start with the beginning of my day. So I wake up late and I sit on the couch with Nick and I don't start working until like noon. Some days, not right, right recently, um, I'll start at 11 before he goes to work depending on how much work I have to do that day and what my energy level is. But the first thing I do, I'm getting into it now. So, um, oh, and please, you know, like this video before you go. Um, let me know if you have any questions in the comments. Please feel free to subscribe and press the alarm button if you want to know uh, when I post more videos because I don't do it very frequently so I won't show up in your feed as often. Um, okay, so let's get into it. So the first thing I do when I get on my computer is I share my closet. I have between 500 and 700 items in my closet at any given time. I would highly recommend you do not share from your phone. It takes twice as long. I have a Microsoft um, Pro Surface tablet thing and then you have got to invest in a pen. They're like $75, but they are so worth it. It increases my speed again by like half. And so it takes me about 15 minutes to share my closet. So that is step number one. After I share my closet, I always go into my news feed and share back any activity. I'll share, you know, I try to pay attention as much as I can to the closets that I'm going into so I'm not double sharing. And I will share anywhere between three and ten items from their closet because, you know, one to two times out of five, they'll come back and share a bunch of my items as well. So I feel like, you know, it's kind of nice when you can trick people into sharing it a little bit more. I guess not trick, but like get them to share more of the posh love. Um, so I go through and do that and that takes me between five and ten minutes depending on what my news feed looks like uh, Okay, and so then after I'm done with that I will photograph the items that I have for the day that I want to get listed that day Anywhere between 10 and 20 items depending on when my next thrift ship is uh, thrift trip is scheduled um, Usually I'll take like the amount of items that I have and divide it by how many days it is before I'm gonna thrift So I never have a death pile ever Death piles are the worst. I don't have enough space in my room and I don't want my money sitting on literally the floor right now because I've just moved into my new office. So welcome to my new office. Nick and I moved and I have my own space now. So anyways, um, I don't have a lot of space. So death piles can't be a thing. Um, all right, so I will photograph the items that I have listed for the day. Um, I'll put up a link for my poly wall, best investment ever. It basically saves your life when it comes to um, editing and having like a really good background. I'll also put down what my lighting kit is which was inexpensive and it hasn't broken on me. So I'll photograph the items that I have for the day and then I will immediately go back and share my closet again and share back any activity. By this time it's been about two hours. Um, after that I will print labels, pull inventory, package and run to the post office. So I'm getting all my shipments from the day before and that morning sent out. Um, and then I will come home. Um, sometimes I'll grab a snack and come back to my office and I will share my closet again. So we're up to three shares a day. Um, again, 15 minutes. These are super fast and then share back any activity. Um, even if you just share one item of the shares, like their news feed, you know, that's still nice. I think that the Poshmark algorithm likes it. I don't really believe that there's like one that's you can't figure out what the best algorithm is but I know that it likes when you're doing multiple things at once um well not at once but like doing multiple things a day after I'm done sharing my closet again so to recap we have initial share photograph share 
package and ship, share, I will stop and I will eat lunch because I'm a hungry girl. I'll eat lunch, I'll sit down, sometimes I'll watch a YouTube video of another um, reseller, uh, or I will watch a stupid TV show. Uh, like, I'm talking like Family Guy or American Dad or South Park. Um, okay, and then after I'm done with my lunch, I'll come back into my office and I will not share, surprisingly. I will get my items ready for the next day. So between 10 and 20 items, I will measure them. I will um, steam them and I will put them back on my rolling rack. And then after that, I will edit the photos that I took that day. I use Lightroom, best thing ever. Um, it's a Adobe kind of like Photoshop, but it's meant primarily for pictures, um, and I will edit those items so that they are ready to list that night. Um, and then I will go back and I'll share my closet and share back any activity. After that, I will start uh, listing my items. So I always list my items in the evening. Sometimes I do them like when I'm photographing too, but very rarely. Um, so I list at night. People are coming home from work. They're stressed out. They need a little bit of retail therapy. So I will list then. Uh, and then the people, you know, that look in the morning at new arrivals will also see mine as well. Um, cause I don't wake up early enough to list in the morning, I'm like a nine to 10 o'clock waker upper. Uh, okay. So after I'm done listing those items, it's about eight o'clock. So I've been working noon to eight. I will share my closet again, share back in the activity and I am done for the day. So Sometimes I'll mix it up and do like different th things between sharing. Sometimes, you know, I usually sh will list in the evening, but sometimes I'll list after I initially share my closet or I'll steam, you know, because I'm not working a nine to five. I am my own boss, so I like to do things my own way, especially if I get bored of the same thing every day. Um, if there are days when I am thrifting, I will share my closet in the morning, go thrifting, come home, share my closet. Uh, hang up the items that I thrifted, share my closet, um, and then sometimes I'll get my items ready beforehand so that I can not have to steam everything the next day. Um, a couple little keynotes, my battery's dying, so we're just gonna hold on one second. Uh, back. Okay, so that would have been terrible if my battery died. Um, so a couple keynotes, I think that's where I was. If I happen to be sharing during a party, I will share at least a couple items into that party. If it's like shoes, you know, I have probably 70 pairs of shoes um, in my closet and I'll share all of them into the party, but it's not super important for me to share to every party. Um, I think, again, that the algorithm likes it and it's sometimes, you know, you might make a sale off of it, but I've found that, um, that isn't always the case. Sorry, I'm refocusing my camera. That isn't always the case. Uh, so if I happen to fall into one of those categories or during a party, I will share into it. Um, I'm not heartbroken if I don't. Um, I clean up my office every night before I leave as much as I can. You know, like I said, I have piles on the floor. Um, and so the next morning I'm starting on a clean slate so I always complete the things that I had on my list the day before so I come into my office and I'm not immediately stressed I love to have my window open when it's nice outside I live in Minnesota for those of you who don't know and it's freaking cold during the winter um, so like it's spring right now it's like 70 degrees outside windows open love the fresh air I always have my blinds open which is where this lighting is coming so I'll be uh, posting more YouTube videos because I'm feeling super fresh um, and then I try not to hang up everything that I get in thrift haul so I have like 150 items or I did earlier this week so I don't hang them up all right away a I don't have enough hangers and b it's overwhelming to me to look at a full full rack um so I like to have you know the days um I have a double hanging rack I'll put that in my description um to buy an Amazon so I have a double hanging rack the stuff that I'm listing that day goes above so whatever's been steamed and ready to go goes on the top one on the bottom one goes my next days um when I'm listing I always inventory right when I'm listing so I'll grab one of my 
bins that is the emptiest and I keep track of which ones are empty. I have handwritten notes on there what my last inventory number was and when the uh, bin is empty I cross out that inventory number just a little bit so that I can still see it and then when I'm listing again um, I know what number to start at and I always bag them up, inventory them, put it in the description because that saves me time and then put it in my bin. Um, and then I listen to music. I track all of my sales on my cat calendar. Um, I make goals for myself and oh gosh, what else? I don't know. Everyone can do their own thing. If you work more of like a midday, like morning to afternoon, you can still follow this that same thing. You can tweak it. You can not follow it at all if you don't want to. It's completely up to you. I just thought I'd share with you guys how I am not overwhelmed every day with my work, um, how I found myself to be the most efficient and happiest, and I love to share, you know, what I've learned from other people, because I didn't do all of this alone, um, what I've learned from other people, and I think that it's very important to pass it around. So with that, I'm all set. Um, and I hope that this helped you at all. Again, please like this video, um, subscribe if you'd like to, press the alarm button if you want to know when I have new videos, and I will see you next time.